Nathan. 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 Hello. Hi. Um. Please, I, I, I need an ambulance, mommy. My husband. My, my husband just collapsed. brother to the man lying in there and this is my brother's wife please what happened um can can i talk to you guys in my no house? tell us here what happened please Ma, your husband is dead what yes actually he was brought in dead initial lab results indicate that he was poisoned poisoned no! <laughs> <laughs> you know you got me on this one, right? Oh, if anyone told you I would not be here for your 35th birthday, they're telling you a lie. Okay? <laughs> Look at you. Eh? Yeah. Turn around. Let me see okay. you. Well, Hello. happy birthday. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> mm. thank you so much. <laughs> welcome. Come, come. 
Yes, I got it just for you. <laughs> So, I know there's no candle on this cake, um, but <laughs> if you were to make a wish right now, what would it be? If I were to make a wish, a mm -hmm. wish. <laughs> okay, yeah, fine. So, this would be my wish. Uh -huh. um, when I grow grey, mm -hmm. and my bones can no longer carry my body, mm -hmm. and heaven calls on me to present an account of how I lived my life. Okay. You'd be the last person I'd want to see. Yes, I see. <laughs> okay, so are you ready to eat? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, yeah, food, well, food to me. Rice and chicken here. Oh wow, <laughs> that's my favorite. Yes, you better eat. I'll be right back. Give me love with sweet past morning. Give me love with sweet past honey. Love with sweet past for me. Too much wine for me. You give me love with sweet past, baby. Yo, oh. I never lie to you. Lie to you. I never change them, 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 them for you. I could just stay with you always, baby. I never lie for you. I never change them for you. I change them for you. I could just play with you. It's just business. We are co-founding a movie. You never learn, bro. Wrote to me, screwed you many times in the past because of the money. And now, what do you know about young men? See, babe, I, I know what I'm doing. Right? I checked distribution statistics since the advent of the big screen. Right, and I realized that a well shot movie with strategic publicity is a win win. How much? It's 40 million. I try. I really, really try. Say, babe, come on, there's no need for you to worry. I mean, every investor tries to diversify every now and then. I'm an investor. Well, at least invest in something you have in depth knowledge about. But baby, if, if I don't try, I won't know. Okay, if I don't, I won't know. Besides, every business has got its secrets and strategies. Okay, most of them I won't discover if I just stand by the sidewalk. I, I need to get involved. I just need you to be okay. And I need you to trust me. I got this. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Are you okay? No, I, I just... It's like a sharp pain, but I think I'm... Oh! Nathan? Nathan? Nathan, Nathan, are you are you okay? Nathan, 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 Nathan. Yes, 
yes daddy daddy i don't know he was really looking forward to his 35th birthday i don't know who would have tried to poison him i'm just i'm so tired of even crying <laughs> yes well he said that he he went to go have some drinks and some food with wrote me his friend but i I don't know what to think. That I, 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 I have to call you back, please. Steve? Officer! Arrest her! I'm oh, Miss Peter Show, Gariba. And I've been asked to bring you in for questioning. For what? For the murder of your husband. So are you ready to speak now? The story hasn't changed. When I walked down that aisle with that man, I swore to love him to my very last breath. Where will I kill? That's exactly what I'm trying to do. Quit trying! Because I have no reason to! Excuse me. Oh. Yeah? Alright, all right. I'll be there. I see. Please save my time so that I'll save yours. Don't you have any conscience? Why these cruel allegations? I am the one whose husband is in the morgue. I am the accused. I am the one whose heart is almost ripping out of her chest. So I'm the one whose time should be saved so I could go mourn my dead. Okay, fine. So why is your why is your brother in law accusing me? after we got married we had um, we had a huge fight the marriage almost packed up and since then nothing has been loose between his brother and I and this fight what what exactly was it about in the past now. Buried it. Oh, well, I want to know. For Christ's sake. <sighs> Couples fight. Well, I'm just trying to ascertain. You're hunting me. The person who you should be asking all these questions is wrote to me. Nathan's friend. My husband said he had we had a drink and food with him before coming to the surprise birthday dinner that I had planned for him. If there's anyone who should be sitting here right now, he should be the one. Okay, so why this guy? I don't know. It's just... He's known for stirring up controversies with Nathan every time they have some money jury deal coming up. 
time he borrowed money from him and then he just went MIA. And now they're co-funding a movie together. And I believe he's trying to get my husband out of the way at all costs. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Get up. I'm going to your house. Can I make a call, please? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look who remembered me today. Hi, <laughs> is Abuja. Oh, you're back in Lagos. <laughs> I say, are you okay? <gasps> oh my God. No, 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 no. <sighs> okay, um, look, I I'm going home now, okay? I'm just gonna fresh your number and I'll come to the house, all right? It it just hang on, I'll, I'll be there soon, okay? Oh God. You said this was the last meal you shared with your husband? Yes, this was the last meal we ate. The food, the drink, the cake. It must all be poisoned, isn't you right? I'm willing and ready to eat from every single plate on this table. I should collapse in no time and join my husband. So you're telling me that if I ask you to eat from this, you will? Yes. Okay, so which of this is yours? Which of the plates is yours? Okay. I want you to eat from the two plates. Is it death? Is not what I wish you. You can search pleasure to watch your potential. It's been a long night, so you can actually go have some rest. I'll have my men take this to the lab for further investigations later. It's okay, it's okay. 
be fine. Yes, I'm coming. Yeah. 
Yes. Wrote to me about bio me, right? Yes, who's asking? Well, I'm here to bring you in for question. Why? For the death of Nathan Anita. Nathan is dead? We don't have all day. Do not pretend you cannot kill us. This... This has got to be some joke or something, right? I was with Nathan last night. Well, it's been several hours from last night till now. And it doesn't even take a second for one to breathe his last. So what are you saying? You want to tell me something? When was the last time you were with him? I said last night. It was his birthday. I called him after work, then we went to have some snail and a bottle of wine, and he went home. And then he was diagnosed to have died as a result of food poisoning. Are you going to tell me what you put in his food or his, his drink? God bears me witness, I did not poison Nathan. Hey, hey, listen. I have bad news. God is not here to prove that to me. Nathan was like a brother to me. I would never have done that. Oh, yeah, he was like a brother. Now, speaking about that, I heard you borrowed some money from him. And instead of paying you back, you create controversy. Now, can you tell me about that? Well, that, that's because I didn't have the money. The first time? I didn't have it. <laughs> and the second time? Well, I, I was broke and so I couldn't pay back when due. So what about the third? Oh, God's name is giving you all this information against me! I heard that he was co-founded in a movie project. I have a detailed analysis of how every penny, every single penny was spent. How much? Forty million naira. And how much? Did you So I'm Look, I can only think of one person who is feeding you all this negative information about me, and that person is not in town. It has to be Nathan's wife, Essie, right? Please, 
my son, I need that alive. I want Nathan to come back to me alive. I don't care about the police investigation. I need is my son for him to come back to me alive. That's all I need. That's all I need. Nathan, Nathan, why did you do this to me? Ah, <laughs> alive. I need that son. So it um, came to my knowledge that while you fought with your husband, you threatened that you were going to kill him in his sleep. You mind telling me about that? Everyone's face things that you don't really mean out of anger. Out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaketh. I don't want to kill Nathan. Nathan? I thought he was your husband. I was expecting you would address him with pet names like mine, my love, my husband, you know, things like that. So the food, the one we took from here last night, we fed it to a dog and, and the dog died. Is everything okay? Pregnant? Who's? Really? You want to add infidelity to my already purported crime? You know, I'll just leave you for now. I didn't kill my husband. The evidence is That will be all for now. Have a lovely day. Talk to me. What did he talk about? What? another suspect over my brother's death, which is his wife. Huh. How could we ever think of such a thing? That night he died. He celebrated his birthday in his house with his wife. That is to say, his wife might have poisoned him. Hmm. 
Anyway, I don't know who is responsible for my son's death. All I need is justice and vengeance from God. All my concerns now is to bring justice over my brother's death. That I must fight for, no matter what it may cost me. Justice. Justice. God. You are the God of justice. You are the God of justice. Come and judge this man. Come and judge my son's death. Oh. Oh. I wish my husband was alive. I wish my husband was alive. Ah. She's still acting her script. Or maybe not. You know there's a psychological instinct with premeditated murder. Yeah. First, it is born out of rage. And then, contempt. Then a plan, and then execution. But you know one thing that beats me though? Not... She's pregnant for her late husband. Now if she wanted this man out of the way, then why did she take him from you? How did she arrive at going to jail? Exactly my point. Exactly my point. Anyways, a killer is a killer. They always try as much as they can to be one step ahead. You know. But I don't like that as me of a guy. Like, I mean, if he shared it with the disease. And if we are lucky, the restaurant should have cameras and which may have captured him poisoning his food. Hmm. You know you're a very smart lady. Yeah. You know that, right? Hmm. I've never been told. Let's go. Hello. Yeah, how do you do? Thank you very much. Um, I want to see your manager. Yes. I am Inspector Shehu Garba, and it's important I see him. Why did you do it? Do? Eunice, are you joking? You really think I killed Nathan? Wow. I could be everything Eunice but a killer. I would never lift a finger. Nathan, that was my husband. 
So how do you explain that a dog ate from the same food and died? I don't know. I don't know. You are lying. Kiddies, I, I have sympathized. It's waiting to talk to me. I'd rather go be with them, okay? I really don't want to have this conversation right now. My guy, don't you think it's high time you go for your brother's property? At least grab the documents first. Yes! Yes! For real? For real, my man. Remember, that woman there, your brother's wife, killed your brother. And they don't have a child. He doesn't have any child for your brother. Automatically, you are the nurse of care to their property. Don't sit back here and watch that woman take away the properties that belong to you. Are you a Mugu? You have a point there. Ah. I suspect that. So, are you a Mugu? As a wise man, I will plan to make my money. Ah, now you're talking. <laughs> <I'm holding. laughs> So as reported, these men had a bottle of wine and some snails at the restaurant of your hotel. Yeah. All right. Yeah, and right. then hours later, this one died of food poisoning. Died? How? How? Are you suggesting that I am we... only saying that I want the CCTV footage of your restaurant from last night. I'm sorry, I can't. I can't help you with that. It's highly confidential. Well, come on, you can't say that. <laughs> Why not? I'm not interested in any footage of um, any other part of this hotel. I just want the one in the restaurant. All right. All you need to do is just play this thing back for me a bit. So last night, that's all. I'm sorry. The control panel of this CCTV is in my CEO's office, and I can't take you there. <laughs> Manager. I will have you know that you breach an investigative procedure of an office of the law. And you know what that means? That makes you and this whole establishment accessory to murder. Now you don't want that, do you? I beg your pardon? This is bigger than you think. I'll say it again. Give me what I want. It will just take me a snap of the finger to seal this whole place down. Until I'm done with my investigation. Now you know that's bad for business, right? That they don't care about human life. Is that what you're trying to tell me? And that is why she accepted to kill a man. What? I didn't kill anyone. 
You served these men. A bottle of wine and some snails last night. Is that not so? Yes, I do. Now this man is dead. And the CCTV footage here shows you retrieving a plate of snow from this man and handed it to the dead man. You poisoned it, didn't you? Why do you have to change your stuff? Leave us. I can't leave you here. There's my CEO of the man. Who hired you? You poisoned that guy. He gave different orders as to how they wanted their snail spice. I found out I was passing the wrong order before I retreat. Mm. From what I gathered from here, Every other customer walked to the buffet to get served. So why not these two? So many persons with best snails. So we'll serve a phone with Do you have a phone? Can I have it? You have written his number on your phone. Do you mind telling me what the business is? Who's
love way sweet as morning. Give me love way sweet as honey. Oh. Give me love way sweet as honey. Too much white for me. Give me love way sweet as oh. baby. Oh, I know go lie to you. I know go change them for you. I could stay with you. Always, baby. I know go lie for you. I know go change them for you. I go to play with you. Always, baby. You didn't take me higher. higher. In love way, I get it for you. No one can contest it. No people. Daddy, I'm okay. No, you don't have to come all the way. When we make concrete funeral arrangements, you can come. Yes, Daddy. Thank you. All right, bye. Why don't you want to tell them the situation on ground? I don't want my parents to come all the way from Munich just to see their daughter like this. <laughs> You're so unbelievable, Essie. Please, please, not tonight. Essie, we are having this conversation. What do you want from me? What would you rather I say? That I killed my husband? How do you explain the dog dying after feeding from the same food? I don't know! I don't know! Eunice! You know what? Just leave my house. You come in here. It's such a bad idea. <laughs> you need me here. I thought I did, but I don't. I do not need you. You're meant to be one of my closest friends. You don't know me? You don't know what I'm capable of? Really? I love Nathan. Yes, we had our differences, but I love that man and I would never lift a finger to hurt him. What do you expect from me? Everyone would think the same. I expect you to say that you believe me. That no matter what everyone is saying, what the detective is saying, that you, my friend, believes me. It's okay. Please. I say. So what do you think? Isn't it obvious? She's been in there for over three hours. Clearly means she's spending the night there. Hmm. As she said, uh, they just exchanged numbers for the first time yesterday. Mm. I think you mean to say the day before, because it's actually a new day. Um, but somehow spending the night there doesn't really mean they're into the crime together. You know, ladies, some of us, we easily open our legs as fast as you can say, Jack. Mm. Yeah. That's just how it is. Let's go. Oh, 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 yeah. So many things that you ask for life It's not how it usually comes but it's okay Oh oh it's hey. okay I know that you are very come. strong No matter what may come your way you'll be fine I should have been know too. it's alright oh, oh, oh. I hate to see you so like this You're you getting what you do not deserve I know you are a good wife to Nathan. You do not deserve this. Stand strong, hold your head 
up high There's always light at the end of the tunnel I've been so consumed with emotion and I fail to think I've been so afraid, I've been so afraid I want to walk out I know everything What if that detective was lying to you? What if he said all of that just to get you to admit something he did not do? Are you saying he was just messing with my head? That's what they do. They mess with your head and make you even question your own truth. I say, if you didn't kill Nathan, I'll need you to be strong. Stay strong, because whoever did this will be found sooner or later. What if he's not found? The truth crushed to earth will someday rise again. I'm... I'm sorry about my outburst earlier. I was... I'm just tired. I know. But really, you should leave. I mean, you have work. I quit. You don't say. There's a proposed merger, though it's not been publicized, but I learned from a reliable source that once it's completed, then one of those will be laid off. So I had to do it honorably. Plus, I've not been meeting my target. You didn't tell me. Yeah, I was waiting for you to return from Abuja. Now what? Well, you know, securing a job in this part of the world is akin to a camel passing through the eye of a needle. <laughs> so, I was spoken to a cousin in Europe and I think I might be relocating. Here it is. Everybody wants to leave this country. Who would then stay back and fix it? <laughs> the very few of you left who have something meaningful going for them. <laughs> it's okay. You have to be strong. Okay. So many things that you ask for life. It's not how it usually comes, but it's okay. I just came back from the club, I decided to stop by and demand for my brother's documents just before your sins find you and uh, put you in jail. Don't you have an ounce of shame? Or at least respect in your blood? Is this what sheer desperation looks like? That has to be you. Not me. Your brother is lying in the morgue. And you stand here. The killer is still out. His killer is standing right in front of me. I know you did it. You just want to get him out of the way and uh, amass his wealth. But guess what? I'll pull you down. I demand for those documents now. Own brother's house. Get out. Well, enjoy while it lasts. Get out, please. We shall see. So many things that you ask for life. 
It's not how it usually comes, but it's okay. Oh, oh, it's okay. I know that you are very strong. No matter what may come your way, you'll be fine. I know it's alright. Life is so fake. No matter what I'll do, okay. Hey! How are you? Good morning, officer. Good Please, morning. if you don't mind, I'm late for work. I mind, actually. I have a couple of questions to ask. I did not kill that girl. Well, I don't believe you. I'm just curious, how do you sleep at night? Knowing that you, or better still, teamed up with someone to take the life that you did not create. Last night was horrible. Please don't make it worse. So you want to tell me about it? What do you want to know? Everything. Officer, I'm late for work. I've not taken a life before. I can't even imagine doing that. I mean, I remember the guy's face and each time I tried to get some sleep, it was right there before me. Pounding you? No, it was just in my head. As I lay down on my bed, terrified, wishing for dawn. So nobody in your house noticed that you were uneasy? I live alone. No neighbors? I didn't want to bother anyone. Besides, I have just one neighbor and he's not always around. So I had to deal with it alone. With what to me, you mean? What? I'm sure you didn't see that coming, huh? AJ, how are... He knows. Who is he? The police inspector. I told you this was the wrong idea. Listen, Ijama, you need to calm down. No, you listen. Stay the hell away from me. Hey, my guy, what's up? No, I'm just entering Villa now. Can we, can we meet at our usual spot? Okay, okay. I'll be there right away. All right. See my God. Man. <laughs> man, this one of is like this. You look so worried. What's the problem? Then you act fast. Yes! Before she will achieve her selfish desire. Yes! Women. Women. Hey! You don't get it, sir. One lie begets another, and in her, in her desire and attempt to protect, uh, or to cover up her tracks and protect Ruth to me, she's even blowing it up the more. So what are we waiting for? Like, I mean, if she could lie about having spent the night at Ruth Mee's place, then there's a very good chance that she's been lying all along. Wow, well, come on, we're yet unsure if she's guilty, even with all the very convincing leads that we have. What do we do? We have to keep digging. We don't have a choice. 
We just have to keep digging until we find something we can indict our culprits with. You know, I told her that the food we collected from from her place that we gave it to a dog and the dog died, and, and she bought it. Interesting. I just wanted to, you know, study her countenance. I wanted to see if she will have this guilt-ridden, you know, expression of a busted killer. But unfortunately, no. I couldn't even read her. I said we just have to keep digging. own brother's house by his wife? A house she had no knowledge of how it was built. No, mother. I will silence her. She must go down. No, down. she must. No, no. 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 Calm down and tell me what happened. How did it happen? I will kill her. Since she can be heartless enough to kill my brother in order to take all that belongs to him. No. She must. She must go down. No. Oh, come on. Come down. Come down, my son. If it is found that that she actually had a hand in the death of my son, she will never live to inherit anything that belongs to my son. Not even a pin. And she must die. Because the wages of sin is dead, as they said it. Mother. I've heard you, but I still have my plans. I don't know what you want to do. 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 Stop now! Stop now! It's okay. Can you forget? Say, cry from now to your next day. Why don't you come back? Stop now! You are hurting yourself. Can you stop? Mama, stop now! Don't let this thing now. Stop. <laughs> Look, if you have a baby growing inside of you, you should develop a tough skin while the storm lasts. How could you? How could you further drag me down the lane after accusing me of killing, killing his brother, my own husband? He's just being insensitive, or maybe not. I mean, who knows? Maybe if you or I were in the same situation, we would act the same way. I understand if he's hurt, but I could have sworn he was here for another reason. <laughs> the man whose voice I heard didn't seem hurt in any way. What are you implying? Oh, I say, don't you think? I have to solve every puzzle for you. Please, if you want to talk, talk to me, I'm not going to stop beating around the bush. So it has never crossed your mind? Not even for one second? that maybe, just maybe, this guy actually killed his brother. Same reason he thinks you killed his brother. I mean, if this guy were innocent, he should be waiting for his brother's will to be read. As far as I'm concerned, no sane man, no matter how aggrieved, would be gunning to claim his brother's property while he's still in the morgue. What kind of a man does that? 
has everything plotted. From knowing that you had a terrible fight with your husband, to thinking that maybe you have not conceived yet, to finally getting his brother out of the way so he could drag you and tie you to the motive behind the murder to your marital squabble. How long does it take to get to Nathan's house from the hotel or, or the restaurant? Uh, 10 to 15 minutes. 10 to 15 minutes. 10 to 15 minutes. But sir, I don't know all the evidence I need to get into this morning after Wrote to me, wrote to me. Wrote to me said the left here the restaurant at 7 p.m. or 7.10? 7 p.m. 7 to 7.10. Right? Yeah. And Essie said her husband came back at 8.55 p.m. Is that not so? Oh, okay. And now it takes about 10 to 15 minutes to get here. <clears throat> so he not have exactly. Exactly my point. He couldn't have um, gotten to his house from here in one hour, in one hour, 45 minutes. 45 minutes, yeah? So something is not adding up here. Okay, let, let, let's, let's, let's say maximum 15 minutes, yeah? So if we take 15 minutes out of here, we'll have 1 hour 30 minutes. Yeah. 
So what was he doing for one hour, 30 minutes? Now, if we can find this, we have our culprit. You know what? I want Essie back here in 30 minutes. I need to be talking to her. You seem to not be making a head with your investigations, so you are sort of pulling me in back and forth. No. I'm tired of being stressed out by you. Fine, you said I, I, whatever food I, I fed him killed the dog, making me the prime suspect. Why am I still walking free? Why don't you lock me up in jail? I need peace of mind. I want peace of mind. If I need to be in jail to get the peace and the rest that I really deserve as a pregnant lady, then so be it. You know, the dog never died. As a matter of fact, there was no dog. All right? I just wanted you to talk. I, I just felt your emotion would give you away. But as it is, I think you're clean. What? Do you have Nathan's phone? Thank you. And who is Steve? My husband's brother. The one who brought you to to arrest him. Hmm. Well, you said your husband got home at 8.55. And Rotimi claims that um, they left the restaurant at 7 to 7.10 7, p.m. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes driving time to get to your house from the restaurant. And it says here that he spoke with Steve, his brother, at um, 7.18. Did he ever mention that he was meeting with his brother? No, but... Wow. But it all makes sense now. <laughs> what makes sense? Steve came to the house, threatening firing Brimstone if I didn't give him his brother's documents. Hmm. All right, I'll keep the phone. And I think we're done here. <laughs> Shut the 
remember before your brother passed, you called him that evening. Where did you guys meet? Really? I just had to call to. Wait a minute. Am I being suspected? I brought this case to you. That man lying dead is my brother. There is someone who's lost my friend. I'm not gonna ask this question again. Where did you guys meet? We did it! I just had to call to wish him happy birthday. At 7 pm? Does that even make sense to you? I had a busy day at the office. That was when I could find time and wait a minute. I have an app on my phone that records every incoming and outgoing calls. Here it is. Hey. How did it go? Still is in. My goodness. What happened? The detectives found out that after Nathan left the hotel, he received a call from Steve. So there's a big probability that he saw that. <laughs> From the first time I saw that guy, I never liked him. And when he came demanding his brother's documents, I immediately knew his hands were not clean. As much as I want Nathan's killer to be brought to court, I just I really hope it's no one close to him. Not rude to me or even Steve. Why? Because I don't think my heart can handle it. <laughs> I will never be able to make this for granted. How? <laughs> my dear, life is electrical. Anybody can shock you. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> So what now? Oh, listen to me. You should stop hounding that woman for her husband's documents. Because she's legally married to him. Now by law, she's the sole beneficiary of everything that you need. Do you understand? I'll call you if I need to ask any more questions. That was quick. Your code is broken, so you should not be hurt. Do you believe that? He had a recording on his phone. I recorded all the conversation. Hello, IJ. I am worried sick. Please call me back when you get this message.
Going somewhere? Yeah, yeah. I'm done for the day. I'd like to speak with the girl. The girl? She resigned. She what? Yeah, she resigned. She got me this morning, uh, by midday, I had a text from her that, uh, that she was done. Okay, okay. Well, that's it. Very good. I've been trying to, to go out. My number has been switched up. So why did you report this immediately happened? I had a very, 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 very tedious day today. I was like, um, I, would, I would go to her house and, and check on her. If I didn't see her, then, then I will call you. Listen to me. If I find out that you're conniving with her to put her to safety, it won't be funny. Do you understand? Lying to die. That's all. Call me if you find out that. Where is the girl? I do not know where the girl is. You know you could have fooled me. Afisa, I am telling you the truth. Well, the truth I want to know right now is why you spent the night with her and she lied about it. I, I, I don't know. Maybe, 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 maybe she didn't want to indulge in the happiness in that relationship. Or maybe this whole thing was a fat lie from the very beginning. Officer, I did not kill Nathan. I didn't. Why is it an issue? Mm -hmm. 
calls only one number, and only that number calls a phone. They, they also send themselves romantic messages. And then look, there's another message from the bank saying that they just opened an account number, and then there's that number asking that the account number be sent. <laughs> oh, come on, sis. Look, <laughs> this is immaterial. The only thing I can make of this is your husband had an affair and he was smart enough to get a separate phone for and it. Why do you talk about this so casually? Like, like it's a good thing to do to your partner. <laughs> I say, men cheat. Big deal. Look, he's dead. He cheated. Men cheat. It's nothing. It's got nothing to do with his death. Okay? Look, this is nothing now. Come on. Okay. What would you do differently now? Hmm? Look, it's nothing, okay? I ah, may do these things all the time now. I mean, this is nothing. Okay, you got a separate phone, so what? I had. At least he respects you. He respected you. Some men will never respect you. He got a separate phone, so you will not know. I just. I thought I deserved better. I was loyal to him. I expected the same. <laughs> My darling. You see this thing called loyalty? It is expensive. Don't expect it from cheap people. <laughs> I beg. Babe, leave all this matter. I beg. This is nothing now. Men cheat. It's nothing, okay? Men do this all the time. There is no man on earth that does not cheat. Forget about it. What should concern us right now is how to catch who killed Nathan. That should be our only concern. Forget about this, okay? It's nothing. Come on. It's nothing. It's nothing. Okay? Ah. Are you sure you're all right? to ask again. Where is the girl? I'm going to you. I don't know anything about her. I don't know where she is. 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 Where? When?
as well. If not for tradition, I don't understand. After I've to reverse myself, do you know what actually killed my son? Just up on the couch when I woke up, you were gone. Yeah, sorry about that. I didn't want to go with you. So, usually comes, so but it's okay. the case is taking a new dimension now. Oh, oh, it's okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I know that Remember you that account that we found on the phone? No what make we found the account of the set tied to the account. Hold on. I you know we saw right. the detective about the phone. Oh, no. Life is so, so the only thing so is. The guy resigned just the day before yesterday, but don't worry about it. The detective and his team are going to fish him out tonight. I'm sure about that. Okay. Yeah, I already made dinner. Um, I think I'll be going to my place later in the evening to speak a few words. What are friends for? You can push in the mountain that will stand before you. Don't give yeah, up, yeah, go on. Yeah. stand strong, hold your head up high. There is all
is dead. So we got to do I see someone obviously missed me. I missed you too, Jacqueline. <laughs> Same. I'm a professional, okay? I'll join you shortly. Hello, detective. The account officer. What about him? Is dead. Someone shot him. What? What? Hello? Hello, Miss Anita, are you there? Yeah. What the fuck? What? Blood. What, what, what do you mean, blood? I just. I just hugged someone and, and, and there's, there's blood on my shirt. What? Hello? Is Anita are you there? Hello? What are you talking about? There's a gun in your bag and then you hugged me and there's, there's blood on my body. Why do you have a gun in your bag? Why is there blood on your hand? Why do you have to shower? What is going on? Oh, you don't want to talk. It's fine, don't talk. I'm going to call it. Hey! You know, I thought you were just stupid. I didn't know you were also desperate to go look for something that's not looking for you. I tried to talk you out of that phone, but no. You went ahead while I was sleeping. I didn't want to hurt you. how boring you were and how you hardly gave him what he wanted in bed. You should be thanking me for doing your job, pleasing him, doing what you couldn't do.
never wanted to hurt you, but you just wouldn't stop, I said you just wouldn't stop! <sighs> you just wouldn't stop. Hey! Stop it! Move, I said! You brought this upon yourself. So you should know. I cashed the 30 million naira check before I resigned from work. Yes. Stay, bitch! I didn't want to use my bank. It would easily be traced to me. So I had to pass him on to a friend in another bank. When he licked, I knew he would flip on me. Yes, I killed him. Shut the fuck up and get down! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I'd like to see you try. I follow you.
know that my late brother's wife wasn't responsible over his death. I don't ask much. I don't ask much. Because her spirit can, could never accept the fact that that girl can lay a hand on her husband who wants her to kill him. Her own husband. <laughs> Who killed my son? This one. Who killed my son? I stabbed you. You know what? This guy has been this part. Hello? Hello? You mean my daughter in law brought a friend to her house that eventually killed my son? Why would she do such a thing? What? She will not be They will not come back from their generation. She will suffer, she will suffer, she will suffer, she will suffer. my money. It is two, two days. Two days. Then I will travel to Lagos. Mm -hmm. I will go and bring her here. Mm -hmm. Take care of her until she puts to bed. Mm -hmm. She gives me back my son. Mm -hmm. Oh God, I thank you. God, I thank you. Kalera mezuka, ezi mela, ezi mela. Kalera, kalera mezuka, ezi mela, ezi.